Hey everybody, I'm here today with a quick math lesson on finding the circumference of a circle. So let's just uh, get right to it. Let's just imagine that we have a circle right here and we know that the diameter is 12 centimeters. So the area from one end of the circle, or I should say, sorry, the distance from one end of the circle to the other end is 12 centimeters. Now we know that the circumference of a circle is equal to pi times diameter. So all that we have to do is make sure that we know what the diameter is and obviously uh, pi is roughly 3.14 but to get the exact calculation I'm going to use a calculator so the circumference of the circle is equal to pi times 12 because 12 centimeters is the diameter now if I open my calculator right here and I'm just going to turn it sideways to get uh, some more options I can just simply do pi times diameter which is 12 pi times 12 and that is equal to 37.69 centimeters but um, instead of doing that I'm just going to round it to 37.7 centimeters so the circumference is equal to 37.7 centimeters and all that I did was I took the diameter and I multiplied it by pi now I'm going to show you another example that uses the radius instead now let's imagine that um, we have a circle just like that and the radius which is the distance from the center point of the circle to the edge of the circle let's just imagine that the radius is eight centimeters so now we have the radius instead of the diameter but to solve this all that I have to do is make sure that I use the radius formula which is circumference of a circle is equal to pi times radius times 2. Very simple, pi r2. And the circumference of a circle is, th is therefore equal to pi, and I'm just going to use brackets, pi times the radius, which is 8 centimeters, times 2, because we are doing, um, diameter is twice the radius. So when we have the radius, we just have to take that number and multiply it by 2. So all that I have to do is put this into the calculator once again, just like this, and I'm going to do pi times the uh, times uh, 8, which is the radius, times 2. And that gives me 50.26 centimeters. So I'm just going to round it up to 50.3 centimeters. And that is the circumference of this circle right here. Um, and that's basically it. In this math lesson, I have gone over the procedure for finding the circumference of a circle. And I have shown you the method that involves the diameter of the circle. And I've also shown you the method that involves the radius of the circle. And you can use uh, either one of these depending on the situation that you have on hand and depending on the circle that you see and also the information that you are provided with. And that's basically it. In this math lesson, I have gone over the two different methods for finding the circumference of a circle. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.